Hello, today we're going to be over how to submit your, your sitemap to the search engines. Uh, this will help your blog or website get found easier. Every time um, you submit something, it's going to be pinging, the, uh, pinging Google, and um, that's what we want. Today we're going to do Google. Uh, you can also do the same process with Bing. It's very, very straightforward. They'll also submit it to Bing and Yahoo, and um, you know it's the same process. So we're just going to do Google. And then um, you know you'll, you won't have a problem doing Bing. This is no tutorial provided by Compete Now, WordPress, and eMarket tutorials that give you the keys to web presence, putting the fast link success. Learn more on our website at startcompeting.com/tutorials. All right, now we're going to get started. First thing I'm going to cover in this video is verifying that you own a site so that you can submit a sitemap. Uh, this is just important because um, you know Google and Bing, they're all going to ask you to um, they're all going to ask you to verify it before you can submit the sitemap. Okay, so. We're going to be using the WordPress uh, by Yoast plugin to do this. I already have it um, installed, I believe, on here. So I'll show you. I'll just go to the plugins and I'll show you which one it is. If I don't have it, I'll install it again. Okay. So looks like I did delete it. So you're going to go to Add New, and you're going to search. SEO Yoast. Okay. And you want this one WordPress SEO by Yoast by Juice Devak. You hit install. Now I have a separate tutorial um, that I had made previously that uh, demonstrates actually. Some of the ways of using this plugin, this SEO plugin, I have that in the description of this video. Um, if you already have this on your site and you already have your website verified by Google, you can skip ahead. There is a table of contents below. Uh, or you can just uh, continue on with us. So now this plugin is activated. You can have on the left side, you're going to have SEO added now. I'm not going to take the tour. You're just going to click on the dashboard. All right, so this is what we have in mind. Google Webmaster Tools is what we want to uh, get verified by. And then there's Bing. So there's ways to do this by FTP. Uh, this this plugin may, usually will make it easier. Will definitely make it easier to do. So you're gonna go log into your Google account. If you don't have a Google account, you need to create one. Go to your account, hit products, and then you want to go to Webmaster Tools. If you don't have a Webmaster Tools account, you need to create one. Once you create your Webmaster Tools account, you'll see all these different websites in here. Well, you won't see all these websites, but you'll see this main dashboard. These are just sites that I have in here. You want to do Add Site. Okay. I'm going to do. I'm going to add my my URL. All right, so that's in there. Add your URL, hit continue. Now you're going to see this. You can either download the HTML file, which is what I was talking about before, or you can go to alternative, alternate methods. And you want to do HTML tag. All right, and then what you want to do is take this content area here, and make the parentheses, and copy it. Go back, hit paste, and save. And that should be it. That should be it. All right. Verify. Okay, and you'll see I've successfully verified the ownership of my URL. So now I'm going to continue. Okay, and now I get this um, main page. Now what we want to, the next thing that we want to do is submit our sitemap. Okay, so let's see. For, let's first get the sitemap URL. So you're going to go down on the SEO plugin tool. You're going to look down on this list and you see XML sitemaps. Click on that. All right. So you want to enable the sitemap. Yep, ping Yahoo, ping Ask. You know, you can uncheck any of these. Uh, I just leave them all all in it. So I'm going to click on that. 
And that, that brings me to my sitemap. S sitemaps, uh, I should say. So you have your category sitemap, your um, slide sitemap, post sitemap. So you're actually going to have to submit a couple different sitemaps, one for your pages and one for your um, blog post. Okay, so even if I clicked on that, all right, there's a, the blog post. I mean, in your blog, you'll obviously have a lot more posts. Um, this is just my development site, so I don't have my, all my blog posts in here. Okay, so now that you have that sitemap link, you want to go to, uh, let's find it now. We want to submit the sitemap, so I just got to find that in their dashboard. Okay, here it is. So right on the main dashboard, you see sitemaps, why I submit a sitemap. I'm just going to click on that, and it bring me here, and I can add, say add or test the sitemap. All right, so now it already has my main URL in here, so now I just got to add to the end post. I just got to take the end of the URL, copy that, go back to Google, paste it in and submit. Okay. Alright, now the sitemap is in there. Now I want to do a separate one for my pages. Let me go back here, the back button. Here's where it says page sitemap. Click on that. Okay. Copy here. Paste it in. Submit. Refresh. Okay, so you can see I have my pages and my post sitemap uh, all ready to go and submitted to Google. And that's all you have to do. So this is another tutorial provided by Compete Now. WordPress and eMarketing tutorials give you the uh, keys to your web presence, putting you the fastest success. Plenty more on our website at startcompeting.com slash tutorials.